Viewer discretion advised. Let's see. 1 plus 1 equals 2 plus 2 equals 5. Oh, 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 hey. Welcome back to another reaction video of... Lou Ratchet, I'm your host, Will Legacy. Today, we're gonna to be looking at when you take your first L. So without further ado, let's get straight into it. Bro, tell me, you seen Pooter? All right, well, best believe I'm fighting that nigga. Cause one, he was hugging my bitch. Two, nigga told everybody in the hood that we got roaches. So, best believe. Matter of fact, I think I hear him and his little bitch ass friends. Hold on, bro. If you wanna watch this ass whooping, you can come see it. If not, stay there. Famous last words. Trust me, I know. That nigga snuck me. Uh, yeah, I think he snuck me. Oh, you think? You think he snuck you? Uh, you look like you got a little, uh, little something, something on your face. You might want to put a ribeye steak up to your head. I don't know, go to Texas Roll House or something. <laughs> All right, let's continue. Because I ain't even know that the fight was about to start. Next thing you know, my ear just start ringing. Dee! Then had niggas break it up when I'm starting to get my fair share. When I started really tagging his ass, that's when niggas broke it up, bro. And you probably ain't gonna hear that side of the story. Niggas is probably just gonna say, oh, Lou got his ass beat, but niggas ain't gonna tell the part when I was, you know what I mean? They broke it up because your face got broke into. I'm just saying, look, look, look. Look at yourself in the mirror, playboy. When I was tagging, when I was hitting niggas with them jabs and straights and shit, when I was hitting niggas with combos, yeah, I gave that nigga the whole six piece chicken tenders. Yeah, I did. Ask that nigga. And you, you <laughs> add, man, don't even ask him for a for. Real. Then the nigga's like a year older than me. I don't see how niggas let that fight go down anyway. How you gonna say you was you was throwing hands, right? You was throwing hands, but then you gonna complain about how older he is, dude? Also, you say you was throwing combos, but I see at least a two piece combo on your face. All right, continue. Because he had his peoples watching. I felt like one of them was going to jump me. That's why, bro, I wasn't in my element. That's probably why, you know what I mean, some niggas think I lost. I wasn't in my element. <laughs> so, so homeboy going to say, oh, yeah, you know, you can talk about the people in the hood. You got roaches and everything else. And you going to say you not in your element? You in the hood. You say you in front of the hood. You in your element. I swear, this is how everybody be capping when they get their behind me. It, just, it, it is what it is, play. It is what it is. I got myself punched in the face in middle school. It is what it is by somebody that was instigating. And I can't believe, like, later on in life, he said, yes, I'm an instigator. Like, who does that? Who does that? I don't understand that. I just like people like that. Don't have people around you that like to instigate. Continue. Outside of my comfort zone. Let's just put it that way. I lost because I got marks on my face? Make it make sense. You know I'm the most fightingest nigga around here. You know that shit running my family, bro. I don't take no losses, nigga. I don't take losses. All I do is beat niggas the fuck up. So best believe next time when I see Pooter, when I'm in my element, it's probably going to be on site. If I see him, I'm going to probably fight him again. Probably. Yo, I understand, man. I understand. We all want to look tough, but come on, man. Come on. Come on, devil. The amount of cap is just beyond the camera. It's just beyond the camera. But anyways, that was funny to me. I hope it's funny to you. I hope I've entertained you. I'm going to do more reactions of them. Obviously, it's hilarious. But anyways, see you guys next time. It's your boy Will Legacy and peace out. This ain't the end. No homie, this ain't the end. We've been the building again.